Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. So we are getting ready for a brand new series of Shop My Stash for 2020. Um, I did do this last year and it was really popular and I'm not sure why I stopped filming it actually but um, I've actually missed it because I do know for a fact that I am not trying as many of the things in my collection as what I used to and also I'm not decluttering anywhere near as many as what I did before. So this is a really focused way for me just to get the best out of my makeup. Um, a lot of the things I have in my collection are from beauty boxes and beauty advent calendars and then um, there are a few items which a lot of palettes actually which I got from like hauls and things in the early days of my channel um, but most of the things actually I bought very little like actual purchases last year other than my subscriptions and um, I have cancelled a few subscriptions over the last few months and I have still got um, a few active subscriptions so there'll be new products coming in as well which will keep it interesting so yeah there's a really good chance that a lot of the things I have in my collection is what you also have too. So um, yeah, I really want to get discovering again, the sort of decluttering and then just finding things that work. I've got so many products which just haven't been used or I've only been swatched, I think, when I unboxed them and they're just forgotten about like in the bottom of a drawer. So yeah, I've learned a lot from last year. Um, I will be sort of making my selection probably for about the next seven to ten days. So yeah, I aim to sort of do three to four of these in month um each week going on from here on i will um look back at the previous week's products and let you know if i like them if i didn't and then um, hopefully give you a bit of feedback that way and then we'll go on and make our um new selection for the coming week um if there's anything that you'd like to see or if you've got any suggestions for how i can do it differently please do um pop a comment down below and do check out my um playlist which this will be connected into of all my previous videos from shop my stash and hopefully you can see it as it starts to evolve and then um, yeah I may get have two drawers empty at the top for the products that I've tried and keep and I'm going to keep and then I can put them in there to try and stop me picking them out multiple times and to encourage me to sort of keep working my way through all the products that I haven't tried yet. So I think that's what I might do and um, we'll wait and see how it pans out. So yeah, nothing's set in stone and it's all very flexible. So we're at two and a half minutes and we've not even picked any makeup. So let's go and see what we're going to choose for the coming week. Right then, so here are my palettes. Um, I'm not really sure what I want to use. I just recently got this one um, from Birchbox in the five pound sale. So I think I'll give this one a little go. It's quite a nice sort of neutrally one. So that's all I'm gonna choose from there, just that one palette. Okay, so this next draw is um, quite a lot of like face type products. So um, I do want to have a primer. So I am going to use this um, Anna Sui primer, which I got in Birchbox. Um, I'll try a different primer as well. One that I've not used for a while. Um, what's this? No. Oh, this one looks, feels like it's nearly done. Let's just use this one as well, which is the Hello Fab Coconut Skin Smooth Priming Moisturiser. So we'll give that one a go. Um, next thing is um, foundation. Now I am actually going to, I'm currently using this one, which is the um, L'Oreal one. So I do like this and I do need to have a foundation which I can trust. So I'm going to put that one out as well. And then, um, have we got any at the back? I have. Let's have a look here. I have a backup of a L'Oreal one there. Um, have we got... Let's see if we can get rid of something here. Ah. Oh, some of these must be bad. They must be needing to go. Let's have a look at this. It looks a little bit... Um, I don't know, it's been sat there a long time. And this one is a Maybelline... Superstay 24 hour. So I will find out if it's the right colour, um, if I like the formula and if it's actually off or not. At least that way, if it is off, I can declutter it. So we'll try that one too. That's all I'm going to use for foundations. Um, next thing. Now, I don't really use powders, so I'm just going to leave my powders for now. I'm not going to choose any. Um, now, bronze. What was shall I do? Oh, I got this one um, in um, Letters in Beauty on my last pick. And it is the NARS Laguna. It's a little mini bronzer. So we'll give that one a go. And then blushes. Let us 
see, let us see. What haven't I used for a while? I'm going to do this one just so I can let you know about this one. This is the cargo one. And again, I think this is a birch box. And it is in Sunset Beach. I'll just show you it there. Oh, where's it gone? It's gone forever. So that is it there. It's a real sort of like nice little sort of mixy one. And it is quite a pretty one for, as far as I remember. Um, so do that and we'll do one more. Um, let's do one of these um, little Lottie Blush Crush. It's quite an orange blusher and it's been sat there for ages. It's really orange. So I'm either going to love it or I'm going to hate it. Um, so there we go. I've got a primer. I don't really use concealer really much. So I'll leave that for now. I think that's all I need for this week. Right, this is quite a busy draw. I have mascaras. I've got um like little mini palettes, eyeshadow palettes. There's some nails and lashes which don't get much use and sponges. I've got highlighters, eye pencils, lip balms, and then single shadows. Um, I really do need to reorganize this draw, I think, but hopefully doing this series is gonna help me. So mascaras. Um, again, I've got one on the go, which I use all the time, and it is um, the um, Benefit Bad Gal Bang. I actually got a twin pack of this on the way home of my last holiday. Really cheap on beauty, um, beauty free, <laughs> duty free. Um, so I'm going to have that. But let's try one that I've got tucked away that I haven't used or that I might want to declutter. Let's see. Actually, let's just do this one and see if it needs to go in the bin or not. And it is a Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. It is quite a clumpy mascara from what I remember, but it may be past its best. I'm not sure, but let's give it a go. Um, I am going to use, I'm going to get this little mini palette out as well. It's a quite a nice little neutrally one um, for work and things. So again, this was um, in Birchbox last month last month, month before. So I've tried it a couple of times. So we'll pop that in as well. Um, now highlighters. Let me see. Let me see. Um, let us put on. What's that? A glitter jelly. I don't think we need that. Not for work. What is it? Oh, it's a little pot of glitter. So we'll leave that for another day when we're going out or something. Um, Oh, here we go. I forgot I had this. And this is the um, Morphe highlighter. Oh, was this in Glossy Box, maybe? Glossy will look fantastic. And it is in the shade Spark. So it's quite a nice golden highlighter. And I'll just see if there's a bit more of a champagne -y one as well that I can try. Oh, hang on. Let's try this. It is. It looks like it's a strobe stick. It's by Revolution. Um, let's give this a go and see if this is something that I want to keep or not. Um, eyeliners. Let's see. I've got so many. I'm going to try and get one that I've not tried before, I think. Let's just get a Tell you what, let's just get a handful and see what I've got. I'll try and choose one of these. What have we got here? Have I got a pencil? Oh, there's the pencil one. That's a model cur. So um, that, we'll try that. And then if I got a coal one. Oh, yep, yeah, that's a coal one. So we'll try this one. And it is. What's this one? I can't make it out. Oh, I think it's um, HD Brows, actually. So we will try that one too. So there's a couple of those. Um, little lip balm. Let's pop in. Oh, a pillow plump. Um, let's pop that on and see what that's like. It's sexy mother pucker. Careful how you say it. And then um, should we do a single shadow? Let's try. What have we got here? There, here's one. What's this? Okay, so this is a little um, single one from the balm called Foiled Again. And it's in the shade Red Handed. So we'll pop that in too. Um... Is that everything out of that drawer? Yep, yeah, let's go down to the final drawer. Okay, so everything here, I've got lips and then I've got some nail polishes at the back. 
Now this is a um, big revolution um, lip vault, which I hardly ever use. I cannot be bothered getting it out today, um, but I think maybe we'll get that out next week and start working our way through the kits. Um, I've had a couple of new pencils. Um, let's pop this one on. So this is a Mellow pencil. And I think it's quite a nudie shade. I do try and keep these ones in the boxes and that way it helps me find them if I'm looking for something in particular. Um, so we'll pop that on. I will also get, ooh, let's have a look. What have we got in here? I, oh, I'm not a massive Matt fan as some of you might remember. Um, I've. I'm on the lookout for a good one. Actually, we've got the matching Mellow. Who are you there? Matching Mellow um, lip paint. I have actually tried this, but I might do. Um, I might wear this on my next video next time, so you can see it. I might even do a get ready with me using some of the products. Is that something you'd like to see? Let me know. Um, and then let's just get a regular um, sort of stick, lip, normal lipstick. Oh, that's nice. Let's do this. This is a um, a Bobbi Brown, and it is in the shade. Ooh, what is it in? Sandwash Pink. Um. Ooh, don't know if that's a wee bit light. I have tried it. It looks like, but hmm, not much. We'll see what that one's like. And then, um, oh, a gloss. We need a gloss. We need a gloss. Um. Let us pop on. Oh, what about this little one in the tube? And this is a Stargazer Treat Lip Gloss. Hmm. I don't even know who what that is. So I can't remember getting that. I wonder if I've got that from a latest in beauty. Have you had this? And can you remember where we got it from? Let me know. But anyway, yeah, there we are. We'll have a go at that. So that is it. Let me turn you around and we'll have a little chat. Right, so we've just made the selections. I want to just show you a bit of a confession about the state of my room. So this looks kind of like not too bad where I'm sat, but I need to sort so much out because there are so many more products I need to put into my collection. And if you want to see a skincare um, sort of video similar to this, do let me know. I'm going to give you a quick peek at what I've got for my skincare and hair care and things. So yeah, let's have a little look at that. Oh, I'm embarrassed. Okay, so this is like the bit that you normally see me when I'm filming, um, which is in a bit of my room. But, oh my God, it's been crazy. I've been so busy. So I've got a bit of crafting stuff all over. I've got products all over. Um, things in here. All these need getting packed away. I've got stuff down there. Stuff here. Oh my word. <gasps> and then coming round to my desk. Oh, there's a the ring light. So this is what I've just chosen here. Um, I've got some things I need to review in there. And then, yeah, coming across my desk. Oh, look at it. It's such a mess. So I've been sorting out and I've been putting my hair products up here. Um, and I've tried to start rearranging my skincare because I had it all in drawers, which I'll show you. But I just wasn't seeing it or using it. So I started to put some serums here and some oils and moisturisers. And then um, more sort of moisturisers and oils. But there's just so much stuff. And then I have in here, there's a drawer where I used to have like my everyday sort of things, like creams and things that I'm using. So yeah, there's a few bits and pieces there. And then I did have all my hair stuff in here. Um, so I am starting to get that emptied, as I say, and putting it up at the top. But then over here, oh God, it's so messy. Um, I used to have a lot of my serum and things in this drawer. So I'm trying to empty this out so I can use these drawers for maybe my crafting things. I've just realised if I don't see my makeup, my beauty products, skincare in particular, I don't use it. So there's that. Then there's just like hand creams, body lotions and things in there, night creams, loads and loads of stuff. And it goes right back. And then in here, got some tanning stuff, um, foot stuff, what else is there, some shower gels and things, and then, um, oh, load, these are all face masks, literally, loads of them, so I think definitely I need to get a skincare series going on, um, and it might just mix it up a bit about reviewing products, and then I've got... And these are things that um, I've got for giveaways. There's some extra things I've got in campaigns. But I've got loads of makeup and stuff back here. Um, I've got 
have loads of palettes I need to just give away. Lots of Revolution ones, some like extras of things I've already got. Um, I did make up a really big um, makeup box for um, my son's fiance um, for Christmas as part of her present. So she got loads of stuff that's been sat here for ages. So she was thrilled. Hang on a minute, turn your back round. Right, so here are this week's products. I thought I'd lay them out just to sort of show you a little bit more clearly. So trying to be organised, um, we have our um, primers here. And then I have a choice of two foundations. And then um, a couple of blushes, my bronzer, my highlighter. And then there's this sort of strobe highlighty thing by Revolution. I am really not sure about that. Um, I have my couple of um, pencils, couple of mascaras. There we are. And then moving on, get a little closer look of the palette that's coming up this week. That's actually quite a nice looking palette. I've only tried a couple of shades really in it. So I'm interested to see if it's one that I'll use or if it's similar to other palettes I've got as well. And then there's this little one here as well, which is quite a cute looking little palette. Um, we've got the foiled one here, which again, these all, all these colours should work well together. But then it also makes you think, is there anything here? Like those two look quite similar here. So, you know, are they the same? That's interesting. I might swatch those side by side. And if so, do I need both? Um, and I've got my little lip plumper. I have my lipstick, Bobbi Brown. I've got my mellow pencil, my mellow liquid lip, and then this little gloss, which actually now I'm looking at it is a bit weird because my gloss is a bit pink. Although that might be nice on top of the Bobbi Brown. We will try, who knows? We'll see what it's all like. But yes, there we go. That is it for this week. So hang on. Right then, guys, that is it. This is everything that I'm going to be putting on my face for the next seven to ten days. Um, if you do want to see a makeup look, do let me know and I will do my very best to try and do that. And that might be something um, that will challenge me for this next year because I never really do any like makeup looks or get ready with me's. They'd be quite basic ones. They're not going to be like really like extravagant going out looks. Very much like everyday sort of looks that are sort of probably quite easy to achieve if I can do them so do let me know I can't wait to get started I'm really really pleased that I'm back doing this so I hope you will join me this year on um, Shop My Stash just to get the best out of the makeup we have we don't need to buy everything that's coming out let's just use what we have and like just use it up let's all get rid of it or give it away or whatever so thanks a lot guys see you soon <laughs> try bye